When it comes to success in tourism, right now, the word provenance is key. People really want to know where their food and wine comes from. You've probably heard of the terms paddock to plate or vine to glass. Well, we have found a place in the Hunter Valley that is winning award after award for its authenticity. I'm about to show you why Margan is at the peak of its provenance powers. Margan is a restaurant, a winery, and a cellar door all in one in the glorious Hunter Valley region of New South Wales, around about two and a half hours drive north of Sydney. Hello, Lisa. Katrina, how you are you? You are totally showing off. I am. This is my favourite <laughs> job. In all the things I do here at Margan, this is my favourite job. Who are you cutting these for? For me? Of course, just to match your dress, actually. <laughs> I thought I'd do that. Um, we pop these in the restaurant. So they're just a lovely styling element so people get connected a little bit more to what goes on out here in the paddocks. This connection is Margan's point of difference and what inspired Lisa to begin the business over two decades ago. The thing our guests love about us is that um, they can actually be more connect connected to their food and wine. Yeah. Where does my food come from? Where does my wine come from? So in the restaurant, everything on the plate and everything in your glass is produced from the estate 100 metres from where you sit. It is also the inspiration for today's cooking class that I have signed up for. So the asparagus has got a window of about uh, a month, four to five weeks. Oh, look! And this is it here. Oh, that looks fantastic. We pretty much do it all. We've got everything, the sheep, the chickens. Uh, we have an orchard um, in the chicken pen there, so we get a lot of figs, citrus, apples, pears. Alrighty, we have got the freshest possible ingredients to work with, so it is high time that we get down to business. Great, so today we're cooking gnocchi with fresh asparagus, peas, broad beans and some of our house-made ricotta. What I'm going to do first is mix the dough together with the, the egg yolks and the parmesan and the flour and then divide it into the logs so you guys can roll your own and shape your own. The aroma of the cheese, the freshly cooked potatoes, it's so yummy. Now we're going to start kneading it and just slowly pressing it and forming it into a dough. Slowly going to roll it into a um, bit more of a log mm -hmm. and then divide it evenly into four. The cooking classes here at Margan are aimed at giving guests the complete experience, from picking the veggies right through to devouring the dishes at the end. Yum! Just work your way along. Perfection. And just blanch these for about one minute in salted water and then refresh Boiling them. hot salted yeah, really water. Hot. Do you okay. want to continue on those? And I'll blanch these off. OK, good luck. So I've just been in the, in the kitchen. I've blanched these in the boiling water for one minute and refresh them. For today, we've got all these beautiful spring vegetables. Uh, we're just very simply going to heat them up gently in a little bit of herb butter, some carrots. Oh, here we go. So we're just going to gently slide them in. Be gentle. Um, and just coating them in that butter and all the, all the vegetables. This is ready. So yeah, nice and simple, very seasonal. Mmm. Played it up, my three favourite words. Okay, here, here we have it. Final Here's product. Yay! <laughs> Thank you. You're amazing. Oh, my pleasure. <laughs> Enjoy. Oh, well done, girls. Yes. Thank you for looking after us today. And we've even got the roses from this morning. Yes. Mm hmm? Mm hmm? Mm hmm? Mm hmm? <laughs>